uh, today we're back with another video and um, in this video I'm going to be showing, discussing and explaining to you the best items in Animal Jam. And I know you guys might be like, you basically just copied Apari, right? You know what? I'm going to give it credit to Apari because this is basically inspired by him. So yeah, thank you. But it ain't exactly right for him. It's because I'm going to add my own little twist. It ain't just the best items in AJ, the best items in AJ for non-members. Basically non-member edition. So yeah, this is still good for members. So if you're a member and you're watching this, don't just click out. You'll never know. This could be really useful for, I mean, at least this can kind of relate to all drummers now. Because when you're like a non-member and you see like Apari doing all those stuff. And they're basically um, a member and they can wear those sunglasses and top hats and spikes and all those sick stuff what they wear and none of this can't. You know, it's basically the struggles what like none of this have to go through. And trust me, I know what I'm talking about because I'm a non member, so I go through it every day and I play Animal Jam. So, you know what? I seriously know, okay? I know. So, yes, I'm going to show them to you. So, this should hopefully help you predict the latest bell trends of Animal Jam and basically the rares. So, yes, but mainly on this channel and basically best items in Animal Jam for non members. So, let's begin. Because seriously, Lately, Animal Jam has like released horrible items, like, this won't be long, but just give a few seconds, like, seriously, what is that? Like, that is horrible, look at that, that is, look at that item, that's ugly, like, what's the point of that flower and all this stuff, it, it just looks horrible, it looks like a, a, a watermelon, it just looks disgusting, like, seriously, it's just like, come on, like, seriously, this is just, man, like, man, are you serious, like, who actually wears that, like, come on, who actually does that, like, let me show you an item. Are you serious? Who actually buys this? No one actually buys it and actually makes it out for you. It's actually horrible. And people who might buy it, that they buy it to get humorous readings to get attention. No one actually buys it from actual outfits. Like what people do with spikes and wounds and all that stuff. It's ugly. Did they really put all their effort into making a pixelated, monstrous thing like this? This is just absolutely ugly. Like, seriously, and bread, and bread hat, what were they thinking? Like, what are they on? Come on. You know, they're just making really horrible items lately. They need to make some real items like back in the day. Like, seriously? So I'm gonna basically show you the good items are from that. So yeah, let's begin. So my first item, I'm gonna say, is bow and arrows. Okay, bow and arrows are actually for non-members and you can actually wear. And you know what? They look pretty good. Like, come on, you can't tell me these don't look pretty good. Come on. That actually looks really good. Like, come on, that looks boss. It looks absolutely bad. And you can make awesome outfits with this. Even including neon bow. Like, don't you think that looks good? And please, don't think I'm bragging about my so-called greys. I'm not bragging, I'm just trying to help you guys. Because I know some people could be a little bit too sensitive and go, stop bragging. Like, I'm not bragging. So if you don't think I am trying to brag, I'm actually not. So, um, yeah, just saying, you know, anyway. Yeah, bow and arrows are absolutely amazing. Like, seriously, they are so damn. Okay, my next item, what I'll probably say, is box hats. Like, box hats are so good. Like, box hats are just like, so nice. Like, okay, I know they're not worth like lots and lots, but they actually look good in certain outfits. You just slam a little box hat on, it actually just completes the look. Because sometimes you've got a nice outfit, but then like your animals use like bowls, like proper bowls. Just slap a box hat on, and now you basically just completely the whole look. Like, come on, that actually looks really good. So, you know what? Big shout out to box hats. That's actually one item you actually done pretty well. And even if looking for the box hats, like, they are pretty cool too. You know, it's actually my other vibe is the same, and I'm sure that would be a little bit more. But, you know, Basically, they're good items. I actually can't see what I'm trying to say, yeah. The next item I'm going to say is pirate swords. Yep, pirate swords, you hear me. Pirate swords are really cool. Like, especially if you're like a big fan of warrior cat, pirate swords are just really useful. Because if you're a true warrior cat, you need pirate swords, you know? Pirate swords are bait. And the thing about it is that they're beta too. They are actually released in the beta days. So, at least you could say you got a beta. Pirate swords, you know? It's pretty cool, and I personally like them because they basically complete every look. They just look good, even in on koalas and Arctic wolf, on wolf, on wolf, you know, fox, snow leopards. They look good on almost every animal, like literally almost every animal. So you know what I really advise, like none of the like pirate swords are like proper the best. Seriously, I advise you to wear them and collect them because they're pretty expensive. You know, I don't got much. But I got some on my back of the car and all that stuff. But you know, anyway. So <laughs> my next one, what I seriously like, can Forget is the one and only straw hat. Yep, the straw hat is like the best item in Animal Jam. Like, you basically telling me that that is not a good look. Like, come on, a blue pirate sword, slam that on, boom, best outfit ever. You look the dankest of them all. Seriously, it's so good. Okay, um, my next one is going to be a worn. Yeah, worns are basically awesome. Like, you know, just slap a worn on and your animal just looks so damn good. Like, seriously. You just look bay. Everyone is really so jolly off you, like, thank you so more, you know? You just basically look the best. Okay, next is, um, red gloves, you know? Oh, just gloves itself. Yeah, I only got one because I don't really collect often. But you know what? Sometimes, especially
just see it on rolls. It's like if you like you know, basically do it on another bed, you actually want a bag of clothing on them. Getting your red rolls, they slap that on. They just basically look the best. They slap that on and they look really good. Like, come on. Maybe not all animals, they look extravagant on, but trust me, on wolves, I've got to say, they really damn do. So, you know what? Big thumbs up to, to gloves, okay? Even if you're not red, it's gloves itself. It's pretty cool. It's complete. So, look, you can even get different colours. And yet, considering I've got a blue one, that really helps me out with this outfit. So, yes. And my, my last one, what I want to do is the door. Right. Okay, this. Okay, this is going to be the I basically like a lovely try on here. It's the headdresser. It's basically the baby version of a headdress. No, no, I'm in the baby version of a headdresser. Come on, everyone in Amazon is in love with headdresses. So obviously having a headdresser is just pretty cool. And um, yeah, everyone loves headdresses. Even not even what it's related, just the look of it is pretty cool. So obviously for those owners who has a headdresser but can't wear any, that's why you can get a headdresser because trust me, it's actually pretty good. And you know what? If you're looking to actually get something really different headdresser, then headdresser headdresses are actually wanted. They may not as rare as headdresses, but trust me, if you are trying to figure out your headdresser, you'll probably get some good because people actually want headdresses. They are actually wanted items. So yeah. Big fat butt Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle